all right after finish the simulation there is only one thing remains which is just render this mesh and for that we have to import this mesh into 3ds max and for that just go to real flow and mesh loader so just hit in viewport and you can see the bin mesh sequence just select this button and select our mesh and hit open so we will get the mesh sequence into mesh loader like this that's it so this is very simple procedure to import mesh into 3d application now it's time to assign some material on it like uh, for egg and for liquid so let's start with the liquid press M you can see the parameters over here just V-Ray fast SSS material because you are going to use V-Ray renderer so like you can see the parameters like overall color diffuse color subsurface color and some parameters then select the egg you can see the egg color here also we are going to use SSS material but a different color like some brown shade alright now it's time to set the lights we are going to use three plane lights V-ray plane lights so you can see the parameters of lights like uh, position you can see position over here then rotation All right now go back to modify panel here you can see the intensity color then light size the 40 by 35 yeah these are some changes in lights now let's select second light the position of the light second light and rotation all right now again go back to modify panel and change the intensity like multiplier color size all right now select our third light here you can see the position x y z then rotation all right now I'll go back to our modifier panel here you can assign some light sorry you can change the multiplier make it 30 then change the size make it small yeah so these are the minor changes in lights now just hit the render setup okay you can see the resolution output size then active time segments and set the output path and output path all right so this is it now just hit the render button and wait for around half an hour to get final sequence all right so let's see how it looks our final output so here you can see our final output yeah it looks yummy <laughs> so I hope you like this final output so thanks for watching this tutorial we will meet soon with another exciting tutorial till then thank you